Remember you, always be true, no matter what you do. I never front it, I got my whole crew life on it. Big shot, man, listen. It's that time again. Pancakes and eggs. When the night is over. Alright, so I'm now at Coach Gym in Car Shorten. You guys haven't been here. Decent gym. Really decent gym. It's a little bit far out, that's why I can't train here that often. But no, it's good, it's good. So today is leg day, leg day, leg day, leg day. I've just finished calves and um my friend Jacob. Which people keep saying he's my twin. I don't understand why. You'll see him in a second anyway. But he's just arrived, so we're gonna be smashing legs, calves done. This morning, as you've seen, um, pancakes, eggs, protein shakes before I came. I'm gonna figure out the macros. I don't, I'm not tracking macros, but for the sake of some of these videos, I'm gonna throw out the macros as well. Kind of to give me a guide of roughly how much I'm eating, whether I'm under eating, over eating, and um, give you an idea of, you know, like how you can structure your meal. So, yeah, leg time. Let's go. Alright, so people keep saying that me and me and my friend Jacob look alike. Today, today, today. <laughs> you guys decide. You guys decide. Basically right now we're working with, um, I'm not sure what percentage one rep max, but I've got a little niggling injury at the top of my hamstring, which I need to get seen, but um, working up to probably about 180 kilos, five sets of five, so starting with 140, gonna bump it up to 150, and then just see how, the, how it feels. done squats now. Um, Jacob maxed out 170. Managed to get the four plates for five. So good progress from last week. Um, what are we here now? I'm debating. I'm debating whether to do hamstrings, quads and hamstrings all in one day, which then leaves me time to do dynamic and sprints or to split it. So push ball legs and then legs again and then one dynamic slash sprint day. I don't know. Alright, so we decided to hit hams. Put some hams today. So here in conventional deadlifts. I didn't want to do sumos, but in this power cage, I can't put my wide enough. So um yeah there's no other space really so Straight one zero one zero tempo. Straight up and down. Pump out 12 reps. Now I did this Friday. And my legs are still hurting from Friday. Today. So, and today's Tuesday. So just give you an idea. Yeah, imagine. Guys, just 
so as you can see I'm eating breakfast I'm gonna head to Starbucks to get some work done took that tip from my ogres actually sometimes it gets a bit consuming being at the house desk so yeah gonna get some work done at Starbucks and then it's pull session today to be a good session not sure where I'm gonna train yet um, Metroflex or pinks or muscle FX depending on if they finish renovations but it'll be good either way so I'll catch you guys in a bit alright guys so I'm back in easy gym to be honest this might be my last month in this gym I need to kind of change my environment a bit and I really enjoyed training at pinks gym yesterday with Jacob um, and I think I'll figure out my split it's gonna be push pull legs and I'll have two variations and then um, one dynamic day and one Olympic lifting day I'll see how I enjoy the split and how it works out but I'm thinking I should do a testing day a test day to see like what my bench my sprint my broad jump kind of like the NFL combine type thing so I'm gonna see if I um, get that done maybe early next week instead of the dynamic day I'll start with that twice the push pull legs so yeah, so that's the plan. Let's get into the pool right now. Four sets of eight. Trying not to swing with my form. I'm trying to just make it nice and controlled. And for all eight reps, no swinging, no jerking. So it's just full control from start to finish. Make sure that I'm not swinging it. But also making sure that I raise my chest as I bring it towards me. See a lot of people when they when it gets hard, they hunch their back over. And it just means that you're not hitting the right the right area. So always lift your chest up at the last bit of the movement. guys and girls that is that session over and done with I don't think I recorded the the bicep stuff I didn't record the rope curls at the end but I did um the seated curls and then uh cable rope curls with like a drop set um, yeah it was a good session yeah this this might be like my last month at easy gym I don't know I feel like I don't like being one of the best people in a place i like to have like loads of other people that like you know heavyweight bodybuilders and all that kind of shit around me because then it it pushes me to grow it pushes me to push myself um you know ha everyone is then to an extent will then be using me as their motivation when i need to use someone else as my motivation um so yeah i'm thinking i might my go to pinks or muscle fx haven't decided yet. I tried that whole work from Starbucks. I don't think I'll be doing that again. <laughs> 
So I'm actually going to be looking for my own office. So we'll see how that pans out, see what happens. But yeah, that's kind of the plan. But right now I need to head to Argos, get myself a new office chair because I broke mine. Um, don't ask how. And then I'm going to head home, grab something to eat. Cool and All right, who recognizes this beat? A big YouTuber's intro. The West Side. 